Welcome back, Dark Souls fans, to Let's Die Horribly in Dark Souls 3. I remain your host, Shadow Fury 333 and we're going to continue trying to kill that giant tree stump-wielding demon thing. Don't know why I have a problem with it. I mean, as much as I've been liking this... Come on. I, there we go. There we go! That's the height. That would hurt me in the process, but... I'm kind of curious what happens if I use the claymore instead. Ow! That was rude. That was very rude, and you should apologize. Ow. You too. All of you really need to be just punished somehow. But I can't be bothered right now, so you'll be able to just get away with it effectively. Ah, not what I wanted. Running out of moss. Hey, look, souls that I don't care a huge amount about, but a demon I do care a huge amount about, or something. Did I hit some? I did! Wow! That was unlucky! That is the height of unlucky. I can't believe I missed one just to hit another one. I think the best option is to run away. It's not the great... Well, it's not really the best option, but it's the best option I have. Wow, this is less than ideal. How much stamina do I have? At least they aren't the most accurate, but wow. Okay, please tell me only one can. Nope. Nope, of course not. Ow. No, I cannot believe that. That was the most unlucky I could possibly have been. Missed one of them, hits the other. I mean, come on. I don't know how I was supposed to deal with that, other than just running and running and running and hoping they lost me, but... Oops. Get my asses back. I only got one poison moss left. Oh, boy. So I think it was here. Oh, hey, there's an item over there. Totally missed that. Yeah! Kill all of you in one fell swoop. What's over here? Wolf's blood sword grass. Hey, that's something I can give to the Farron's Covenant. I noticed that they're they're leaving Covenant items around everywhere. A leaf signifying a duty fulfilled by the watchdogs of Farron, who stand beside the old wolf to ensure the serenity of those at rest. Depicts a sword grass leaf stained with dried blood. Long ago, the sword grass leaf quickly identified members of the undead legion. In the rotted forest rest the spirits of the warriors past. Their acceptance of and gratitude towards their guardians is expressed eloquently by the humble leaf. So yeah, covenant allegiance item. What I really want to know is where's the sunlight medal supposed to be deposited to? I got all these sunlight medals and I'm actually going to change course a bit. I noticed there's an item up there. I noticed that there's a path to get to those items without poisoning myself too much. And that may be an alternate path to where I want to go. More Estus soup. Hey, Sunlight Talisman, what is this? Hmm, not as good for spell buff. Knight of Sunlight's personal talisman for casting miracles of the gods. The talisman bears the knight's own holy illustration, an emblem of his unwavering faith. Use of the talisman skill fills the user with similar steadfastness. Is this supposed to be Solaire's? I mean, it doesn't look like this is good. Well, Estus Soup. That's just healing, which I don't really need right now. I'm gonna leave that there for now. Is there anything else that looks like it's out here worth grabbing? Not really. Just a bunch of trees and muck. You know, come to think of it, this is actually not even so much like Blight Town anymore as it is like Lost Isolith. Hey, this is a good area to fight this thing. Now that was intentional. <laughs> that time. Rather than the time I missed and got myself killed. Which I suppose teaches one the virtue of accuracy, but... That one is locked on, so I'm not sure how much I could have really done to be more accurate. Come on. 
Oh, that was supposed to be summoned? Ow! How the heck did that hit me? Oops. In the poison muck. Okay, what game? Come on, I'm hitting the space bar. Or releasing the space bar to be more precise. Man, that's annoying. The support that it has with those... Okay, what? Did, did the dodge function stop working all of a sudden? Like, I, 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 don't, I don't get this. I, I'm hitting the space bar. I'm releasing the space bar. I'm, I don't know what's happening. This is getting progressively more... I'm getting annoyed, and it's causing me to die. Hey. <sighs> I need to get through those enemies. That's the problem. I mean, I'm glad I found a better way of doing it, but still need to get through them eventually. Oh, great. That was the worst outcome. All right. Don't want to drink the Estus soup, though. Ay. Did you get over here? I come to think of it, I need to heal up in the meantime. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, now I'm ready. lock on issues. Ah, why the spirits? There's nothing quite so annoying about this enemy as the... What? Okay, I stand corrected. There is something quite so annoying as the enemy throwing spirits out and stopping me from attacking because I have to dodge them. And that's whatever the heck that explosive attack was. Hmm. Welcome to Dark Souls, I guess. Again, I missed this? It's like, I thought I found the right spot, now I seem to have found the absolute worst spot. Ay. Okay, you know, I'm just going to switch back to the other sword. That seemed to be doing a better job. Also gave me more flexibility in that I could more easily just swing. I there are more free spots when swinging with a lighter weapon, which is why I have the backup weapon of a straight sword. And the claymore is kind of the main weapon, but then the straight sword is kind of a backup weapon. But if I'm going to be playing this... I mean, I kind of want to do almost bloodborne type thing. I have to be the opposite, where this, the straight sword is my main weapon. Okay, way too early. I'm getting paranoid now. I'm getting really paranoid. I just... Ugh. I'm getting paranoid and frustrated and just not working out. <sighs> When this episode comes out, please, please tell me in the comments whether or not this is boring. Like, whether or not me trying over and over again to kill an enemy is boring and I should just cut past all of it. I really don't know. And if you're wondering, that is the source of my frustration. It's nothing to do with the fact that I'm dying. That's... whatever. That's part of Dark Souls. You know, it's just part of the game. Stuff kills you. It's not the easiest game in the world. Whatever. I can deal with that. My concern is boring you guys. So if I'm not boring you guys, then it'll help me feel a lot less frustrated. But if I am boring you guys, then I'll just make sure to edit if I have to do these runbacks. What's my hauling right now? 20? 40? Wow. Goes up by 5 every time. Also, before I start this fight, one thing I want to point out. I noticed this Dark Sigil, that's the number of levels that I've taken from Yule. The number there, that that's what that number is. It occurred to me re-watching the footage. Hey, there's a number there. You know, I'll be kind of embarrassed if it turns out that the real solution to all this was just to go around. I don't actually have to fight these things. Where the heck was that one? That was it, right? Ugh. Maybe I should just go around the other way. No, that's not a great idea either. I mean, if I like being poisoned, it's alright, but I don't, so... Ah. Not ideal. But I guess it's worth finding out what's over... Oh! I know it's over here. This is where I came in in the first place. And I was looking at those weird goat monkey things, and I thought, I don't want to deal with those. 
And I saw that weird tree th demon, and I thought, I don't want to deal with that. Turns out I didn't have much choice. Or maybe I do, I don't know. I have one poison moss left, I think. Yeah, I have purple moss clump. One purple moss clump. Although if they're purple moss clumps, does that mean they're blooming purple moss clumps for toxic- Oh, darn it. Okay. That's it for Moss. Oh. What? Okay, so if there's no spirits, I've got to be really mindful of an explosion coming. Let's get cover here. And if there are spirits, then I have to be mindful of spe- Ow! Ow! Okay, now I'm getting frustrated for real. I'm... How do I get through this? Efficiently. This is not efficient. Okay, and actually I'm still in, am annoyed because of the possibility of being annoying to viewers. It, it really is that. <sighs> okay, it's kind of a bit of both. Oh, come on. What am I supposed to fall from? Oh, right. I have no poison moss left. That's not an option anymore. At least not if I want to survive it. Crap. Great. So I'm out of poison moss and I have no way of easily dealing with these enemies. I have difficult ways, but no easy ways. No easy ways that make good YouTube content. What? Ah, oh, stupid collision detection. Like, clearly they don't- they do not respect collision detection at first. Okay, and just run. Are you gonna be locked onto? Come on. I mean, I can shoot from the hip, but I don't want to. I don't have to. Okay, well, that'll work. I mean, I've got a pretty good position to work for. Ah! I'm getting really impatient right now. Like, I have no patience left. This sucks. I need patience to win, to get through this alive. The only way I can get through this alive is by being patient, but I'm running out of patience because I want to get through this by the end of the episode, which is in about 15 minutes. Or more precisely, I don't want this to be the entire episode. Okay, that worked. What the heck is the distance that I need then? Hi. Hi. All right. I wish there was a rusted iron ring or something I could use to get through this. I'm gonna guess it's probably either back up in the bog by the crabs I didn't want to work through, or near the Black Knight, or behind the Black Knight. One of those two, most likely, and it would make my life here so much easier. Maybe I'll just check those out. If I don't kill these by the end of the episode, I'll just check those areas out between episodes. I don't want to bore you. Something's annoying as hell. Oh, great. Last thing I wanted to jump there. Oh, man, these spirits are annoying. How am I supposed to do anything when I have these things chasing after me? Oh, crap. I'm within... Ugh. And I realize I can walk kind of out of the way, but it's not really that great. Especially not when I'm trapped by the terrain. Ah, shoot. I keep thinking I'll stagger these things for some reason. Ah. Come on. Why must you summon things? 
Oh, finally, but I don't think I'm gonna survive that. No! So close! So close to getting through that and just getting the other one and finishing the whole thing off. Sheesh, this is annoying. So annoying. Ah, final. Ow. And this is why I was fighting near the Estus soup. Because then it could heal up. Okay, that's one down. Now I've got to go around the other way to deal with the other one. I just, at this point, I have to run back again. I won't go that way because I don't have any more Estus soup. Can I get the Estus blast back for doing that? I do not. So I use two Estus. I guess I use two Estus where I might have otherwise used three, so that's an improvement of sorts. Emphasis on the of sorts. Ugh. I'm betting there's a rusted iron ring equivalent back up at the other place. I am sure of it. It's like, there's, it's got to be somewhere around there. It's like, this game has no place to go back to. The Cemetery of Ash, I'm pretty sure I fully explored. There was a bit of a castle area behind it. Didn't really point out at the time. But I don't think that's the way this is going to go. I think it's something up in the marsh. Not this part of it, the upper part. It actually occurs to... Oh, I guess it'd be over there. Never mind. Is it not directly above me? No, it's not directly above. Oops. Well, that was a waste. Where's my... Okay. Full mana, at least. I don't want to do this. Hmm. An area with cover is always nice. Wow, I'm full of muck. That's great. Think if I go now. No, nope, I'm gonna get poisoned. Crap. All right, what's back here? Okay, I don't know what... Sorry about that. Something crashed, apparently? Not the game. Okay, well, whatever. It looks like the recording is still going, so... No worries there. Oh, right, it can still hit me. I... Darn it, I can't tell what's going on! Okay. Why is this game not locking on to stuff when it's in my screen view? Man, please let this be the time when I actually successfully kill this thing. What? No, there's there's a wall here. I need that wall. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. It's finally dead. It's finally dead! I finally killed it! Oh, thank goodness! We can make progress and put out this flame and actually open the area I wanted to open at the beginning of the last... Well, the last episode, actually. But then I found the cool other area with cool demon fights rather than these really annoying tree demon fights, whatever they are. Which I guess opens this door, the way to the Cathedral of the Deep. Hooray! I actually made progress! Alright! Hope the runbacks and constant attempts didn't bore you. I don't know if I'm going to keep those in. Or how much I'm going to keep those in. But, hey, we made some progress. We can move on and get out of this swamp. Although I will still check if there's a rusted iron ring. Or something like it further up. Oh boy, that's not good. Although, as I mentioned before, that does mean that I don't have to worry about whether or not... Oh wait, there's a path up here. With enemies. Enemies that... Ow. Oh wait, no, you didn't hit me. 
Now you hit me. Ow. Oh, come on. I just... You ruin everything! I cannot get back here! There's too much to go through to get back here for me to get back there! Great, well, forget that entire area of the game. We're never gonna see that. We don't have time. I'm gonna go back to where that gate opened. I might deal with it later if I can find more poison moss or if I can find that rusted iron ring, but if I can't... No. I just... I can't get through there, apparently. Not reliably. I mean, just think about the amount of attempts it took me to get as far as I did. I can't get there. I can't believe that thing killed me. And if you're wondering, no, I actually didn't actually edit out any swearing in that one. I didn't swear. Really wanted to. Really, really wanted to, but I'm trying to avoid having swearing. Well, much swearing. Certainly not the F word or anything on this. So, restrain myself. Probably when I turn off the microphone, I will scream, though. Because that was really annoying. Like, the worst possible timing there could be for that sort of... Ah, stupid tree. Not sure if Frostbite's really giving me anything here. Thank you for telling me to try left, though. And now I'm really annoyed and curious. And I have two areas. Area behind the Black Knight and the area behind that other demon area that I don't know how to get to. That I have to explore at some point. But I can't right now because it would take too long to go back and do more runbacks. And it just, it wouldn't be interesting. So I'll have to do it off camera. Ah, oh, you're annoying. What? More health? How do you have more health than the others? Well, actually, I guess it's kind of typical in Dark Souls. Enemies encountered later on, even of the same type, usually do have better stats and better health. It's usually much later on, though, not just the next area. Oh, Basilisks, my favorite. Well, I guess we'll know that curse is petrification in this game. Well, now I'm curious. It's slightly suicidally so. Oh man, there's a bunch of souls up there too. Well, forget it. Those don't exist. Because I'm never going to get them. I mean, on the other hand, the enemy has, I killed are respawning enemies, so I didn't lose much. But yeah, like I said, that's going to be an off camera run back. That is not going to be on camera. Oh, come on. Get hits. Man, everything just kites just the right timing. So hard to hit anything in this game. Ah, another one? What? That has never happened to me before in a Dark Souls game. Ever! What the hell? Why is this a new experience? Why, I mean, why is this happening at all? That's not supposed to ever happen to me. I'm supposed to be better than that. Like, I don't get cursed. I don't get petrified. A basilisk has never done that to me before. I can't believe I suck so much. I'm getting worse. I'm getting worse at this. I can't believe this. Ugh. That's never happened to me in, in two or one. Ugh, I don't believe this. I'm never going to forgive myself for that. Like the worst way to die. I've... I've proven I'm totally incompetent at this. If you don't want to watch anymore, I can totally understand why. Although, on the other hand, it's called Let's Die Horribly for a reason, not Let's Kick Butt Hor- or not Let's Kick Butt Wonderfully, because... I figure stuff like that would happen. But not that, not specifically that, that's one of those things that doesn't happen to me! How dare you injure my pride game. Now I have to run back and do that all over again. Just to show those bloody basilisks who's boss. Wow. Hero starting out nice and pleasant. Like I said, every time I start out nice and pleasant, end off mean and salty. Because things are taking longer than I figured they should. 
This is a common problem I have. I normally expect things to take a much, much shorter time than they actually do. But, well, I don't know. What else am I supposed to do? Well, no point getting too close to these, then. Apparently, they're, they mean business. And also, that's the reason why I don't really like the way that kiting bullshit happens. Get over here. So I can deal with you quickly. Before your friend comes along. I mean, at least cursing doesn't have your health this time, still. I mean, I guess you have enough stuff that reduces your health, you don't need the curse status to do that, but then what does curse do other than instant kill? I guess it just instant kills you now. It used to be you die instantly, and then your health would be halved, and it would never be unhalved until you got the curse removed. There are specific people that could do this for you, but it was the only way to get it removed. Ah, of course. It was the only way to get it removed. Golden scroll? Oh, hey. You're not a mimic. Always good to check. Hey! Dusk stuff! That's neat. Hey, I also... It's a skirt! It's a skirt! I get a skirt. It's not my favorite type of skirt, though. It's dusks. Skirt sewn in a long-lost fashion. The ele elaborately embroidered ivory-colored silk is imbued with an ancient magic power. No protection is offered by this garment, as it was never intended for battle. What, really? Well, some is a lot of elemental protection. Though I suppose compared to what I currently have, it's not much better. How does it look, though? It... doesn't mesh super well with this particular setup. What about nameless knight armor? That's eh, better. I have to do some fashion soulsing to figure this out. But hey, I've got. Oh, what about mirror vest? It looks all right. Still got some weird fabric physics stuff going on, but this looks all right. I kind of like this. It's not perfect. Not quite what I was going for, but it's not bad. Okay, that's the heaviest I can go for. All right, well, that's kind of cool. What I'm going to want is Elite Knight Armor, and I'm going to want something more like Dingy Skirt rather than this, but that's eh, something. I wonder what kind of resistance it gives to poison or anything else. Oh, crying out loud. Okay, well... Oh, come on. Get hit. Also, why am I running away from the poison? I am poisoned! I'm already poisoned! I have nothing to be worried about anymore. I can't be super poisoned. Well, I can, but not while I'm poisoned. And it's called toxin, but yeah. Or toxic, rather. Moss fruit. Temporarily boosts bleed, poison, frost, and curse resistance. Okay. Good to know, but I don't like temporary things, at least not in the first run. Because I'm never really confident I'm going to be able to actually make use of it all. She's serious a maze. So many places around here I have not explored yet. And other places that I would have explored but got killed before I had a chance to properly do so. And I need to end the episode pretty soon. It's just about time. I think it is basically time to end the episode. <gasps> you! Although I lost the souls that were here. No! No, 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 no. Okay. Don't lock on. Now lock on. Ugh! Not again! Why don't you take enough damage to die? Sheesh. Again. I am so annoyed. Not ending it there. I'm killing that enemy before the episode's over. I am killing that enemy. I need my vengeance. Ugh, finally.
Finally! You rat bastard! <sighs> okay, whatever. I'm just gonna end the episode here. Have a good night, everyone. Or at least better than I have. Man, stupid pieces of shit.